Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your boy Drew here, and I'm back with episode two of this Fulham FC career mode. In the last episode, we just got our feet wet with this whole Fulham career mode. Um, we got some good transfers in. We got Christian Pulisic. We got um, Moreno as a left back, and we also played our first game, which was very embarrassing. If you guys are just finding my channel, um, <laughs> I got my ass kicked by Crystal Palace at home, 4-0. Not the best first impression. Not the best way to start off a career mode, but who cares? We'll bounce back. I mean, we're going to play Tottenham away, but I, I believe in myself. I believe in you guys believing in me, so I think we'll do good. Um, so let me just look at my transfer hub. I want to show you guys I've been scouting some players, making sure um, build my nice American group of players in Fulham. Uh, as you can see, as you can see, they're all from the freaking MLS. I got Tyler Adams here. I think he'd fit in great to my team. Got Zach Steffen. I think I'm definitely going to go for Zach Steffen. Maybe this transfer window or maybe the next one because my keeper right now, I believe I'm not feeling my keepers right now so I don't know okay Andrew Carlton Ezekiel Barco definitely gonna go for Barco from Atlanta United what a wonder gem and Alfonso Davis there's just so much good young talent coming up uh Brooks Lennon whatever these are just like random just, like, just in case I want to buy more people but my main targets are definitely Davis Barco and um Stefan so keep it keep keep following along guys because we're definitely gonna build a nice American squad uh, but I don't want to keep talking. I want to play this freaking game. I want to I want to win a game I want to show you guys that I'm not that bad. Um, I am pretty bad, but <laughs> not that bad So uh, let's just get into this freaking Spurs game. Uh, let me make sure this, this squad is good with Mitrovic, Cezignon, Pulisic I put Anguissa in here instead of McDonald because I feel like he's just uh, been around more stronger and everything. Tim Ream instead of uh, Chambers, but uh, we'll see how that works out. Oh, I want to change my goalkeeper. That's what I wanted to do. Uh, Fabrizio I wasn't told, I'm really feeling Fabrizio, but uh, I feel like he was too short, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna put Rico in there instead. Rico's much taller, probably better reflexes, so let's see if we can win the second game, guys. If I sound a little um, off today, it's because I am pretty off. My throat is freaking killing me. I think I have like a little chest cold and throat cold coming in. Um, so in between takes, in between cuts, I'm coughing my lungs out, but I'm still here recording for y'all. Because I love y'all, and I love this game, and I love to play soccer, and I love, and I love everything soccer-related, so... It's all worth it, alright? <laughs> See? <coughs> alright, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, let's do it. I want the high pressure going on. How do I do high pressure? Team press. Let's go. They totally changed those little buttons when you, you know, make it more attacking, less attacking. All those options. Um, let's do it. Seti. Tom Kearney. Oh, what was... Oh, my God. Guys, if you guys didn't know from the last episode... I suck at defending, and I don't think I'll ever get good at it because I just don't trust myself. But, and how do you get, oh, well it's Dyer, I guess you can out-muscled by Dyer, whatever. Uh, let's just get the ball, let's keep the ball for more than five seconds, and then maybe we'll create a chance and actually score, and not get our asses kicked again. Thank God, Sergio Rico. Okay, perfect, perfect, Misha Richard, on the run, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, why are you so, how is Toby, Toby on the Royale faster than you? I need like a, you know what I need? Like I need like a pacey striker, like someone who's like, not a fucking tank and just so slow. Goal! Goal! Oh, goal! Yeah, I said goal like three times and it finally happened. Boy! Our, so that was our first goal of the career mode, of the whole series. Took us uh, a second game, not too bad, but whatever. Oh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> first goal. I'm excited. See, Tottenham? You guys aren't going to fuck around like Crystal Palace was because Crystal Palace kicked their ass. That's not going to happen again. I learned how to play the game better. I feel I, f I have a better feel of the game of FIFA 19 overall, so I think I can manage. So I'm gonna. It's, it's still world class, I think. I looked at a world class, definitely. Yes. Just shoot it. <gasps> Pulisic! Does that count? Yes, it does! <laughs> yeah! Boom, boom. Pulisic's first goal since being signed from us. This transfer window, guys, this is a little, we're doing good. Oh, let me make sure you guys know that I'm not using sliders. Like, I'm actually not that shitty at this game. I just wasn't ready for that onslaught of Crystal Palace. As you can see, everyone's still here, fitty fitting, no slider, because I ain't no bitch, I don't use sliders, I ain't no bitch. <laughs> uh, so yeah, we're good. This is just me kicking Tottenham's ass. <gasps> no. Rico, what was that? Why did he just like lie down and like came to shoot it over his fucking head? I was like zoned out. <laughs> I was not. 
in the right state of mind. You know what? We're getting too comfortable. That's why I was like, yeah, I'm 2 0 up. We're good. We're going to win this game. But look at that. Now we're only 1 0. 1 up. So we got to get our fucking head in the game. All right. Not a bad first half. We got 2 0 up. We got scored on towards the end of halftime. But we're still winning the lead. We're still in fucking control. Uh, Sarah's looking like he's kind of running out of lungs here. Um, maybe I should switch him out soon with McDonald or something, but we'll worry about that in a little bit. He's got some some energy left. Uh, let's just keep him, keep momentum going and not get too comfortable and make sure we stay our heads in the game. You know, you know the drill, right? You know the drill. I'm gonna make a run for it, Pulisic, go. Yes, he's onside. Boom! That's, that's game over, boy. That's game over. Pulisic with a fucking brace against Tottenham. Second game in, in the lineup for Fulham. Second goal. Boom. It's over. It's over, boys. I just can't get too cocky or I'm going to lose my composure and then I'll lose. But we're done. We're going to stay focused. Damn, what a fucking goal. What a pass from Tim Ream, was it? American to American. Perfect. Boom. That's how you do it, boys. That's how you fucking take down Spurs. Um... Sorry if I really wasn't celebrating too much, too crazy. Uh, I just don't want to use my voice that loud because it's like killing me. But look at that. 9.4 rating for Christian Pulisic. That's perfect. So he had a perfect game. Two goals. Always a fucking threat. I'm excited. I'm happy that we didn't lose or tie. I'm, I'm glad we're back to winning ways. Well, we're in our winning ways now. Uh, I think I'm going to fit one more game at least into this episode. But um, let me just real quick. Train our players a little bit. Yeah. So yeah. Um. Uh, maybe I'll go for Zach, Zach Steph in this transfer window. Wait till the, the um scout comes back. Let me know how much how expensive he is and what his contract what his stuff is looking like. So yeah, whatever. All right. So they want at least nine million to twelve point four million for Zach Steffen. Uh, or I can pay his whole release clause of fifteen fifteen million, and. I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm going to try to negotiate with the club. Maybe I can offer them one of my keepers or one of my um, excess midfielders or strikers. And maybe they'll allow me to just cut a deal, cut a break with Zach Steffen. Let's do a player swap. Let's go for goalkeeper for goalkeeper. Fabrizio really wasn't digging him. So let's try that. He's 80 rated. You're going to want him. Let's suit our needs budget. We are an engine for Fabrizio. But we're looking to bring in a fullback. Goalkeeper. You just said full, fullback, goalkeeper, or midfielder. That's exactly what they just said. Let's try another goalkeeper. Let's try Bettinelli. We can't let Seven unless you pay our suit of our needs, man. He just said we're just in the goalkeeper, but not that goalkeeper. Fine. Call for other positions. Let's go for midfielders. Um, Cisse, I was kind of trying to sell, I think. Let's see what he says. Okay, plus 15 in cash? You're fucking nuts, bro. You're fucking nuts. How about like 12? Oh. Uh, let me try one more transfer fee. But I feel like he's gonna get mad at me and like not want to sell him. Okay, uh, what about a sell it clause? I should do like this. What, what I'm not gonna sell them, so this, I'll, I'll give them the biggest sellers clause is there is. We're getting closer, but that offer slightly below that. Where's <sighs> I'm just gonna do it. See, I I can't play hardball here. I can't like negotiate well. <laughs> Whatever. All right, let's get let's get this Zach Steph in negotiation, and then we'll get into our next game against Burnley. And he can start the first game. I think if we sign up, he'll come right away. So. Let's do that. Okay, you can be a squad role. Uh, oh, how about important? Because I have an 80 overall player. Oh, he's got a real face too. That's awesome. And he wants to be an important uh, player. That's good. Contract length, how about four years? Does that work for you, Bo? Okay, good. See, I like when they give me the, the options because I just like, say yes to all the players all the time. No release clause, definitely. Ain't no one going to buy you out. Uh, 23,000, that's not that bad, yeah, whatever. Alright, so we got, what, like, 10 mil yet to spend, but I don't think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna save it. I do really wish I can go for Tyler Adams, but 
Maybe I'm not. Maybe we're good. But now we have assigned a top player, it says. I got my little five notification thing. Um, so let's put him in the fucking squad, boy! Alright, so I just figured out that Sergio Rico is actually on loan to us from a, another team. So I didn't know that part. But um, So that means we're going to make Zach Stefan our main keeper. Fabrizio will be our backup. Or I mean, Rico will be our backup. And everything else looks pretty good. I put Cabano on the transfer list because I'm not really interested in him. I put Bettinelli on the transfer list too. If I don't get it off for him, I don't care. Maybe I'll just replace him with Rico. Try him out a little bit, but um, he, he is injury prone, so there is that. I'm also trying to loan glitch uh, De La Torre because why not? He's an American player. I want him to be better than he's going to be. So without further ado, y'all, let us... Oh, is that a mutual reach? Let me try Kamara up front just for this game. Let's just see how it looks like. Um... Let's do it. Let's get the burn. Let's kick their ass. All right, here we go. Zach Steffen leading the line. Well, not leading the line. Covering that freaking goal. Oh, I should give him a number one t-shirt or a jersey number. Uh, we'll fix it when, we, when we're done with this game. When we're done, body in Burnley. And also, they just said that Burnley has the, the striker with the most goals in the league so far. So, let's make sure he doesn't fucking score on us. Because I am trying to be one of his targets. I don't know who it was. It didn't show. It just, it just zoomed into the dude and was like, oh, top scorer in the league, blah, blah, blah. We ain't gonna score here, I'm telling you right now, boys. Boom! Oh, what a fucking save by Heaton. They're defending pretty well, Burn. I gotta give it to them. Uh, I've been, like, up their ass at the box. But they just keep cutting my passes out. They keep intercepting everything. Keep going on the break. So, I'll give it to them. They're doing pretty good. They're playing way better than Tottenham was. We already had two goals at this point against Spurs. Clear that shit. What if we're just like worse at home than we are away? That would suck. All right, all right, I'm ready for this. I had a nice, good stretch. I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's do it. They started without me. I was having a nice stretch, and they go and they fucking start the game without me. That's cheating. They deserve to lose now. Oh, nice cut out by Mawson. Careful. No. At least it wasn't Chris Wood, the highest goal scorer, but still. Fucking shit. Who was covering Hendrick? Nobody was, huh? Boom. Oh, so close. All right, let's get, let's get some fresh legs going here. Uh, Kamara, you've done jack shit this whole time. Uh, I'm going to try again Andre Shirley up there. We're not coming for Brian. And then maybe a little later I'll make another midfield change. Probably take Sarri out again. Seems like he like runs out of his lungs like so fast. Damn, what the hell was that? He went flying. Come on guys, let's at least not lose again at home. Our fans are gonna fucking hate me because I'm the manager. Shit. Good Pulisic, nice run. Just cut inside. Just score! Oh, man. Let's get, a, let's get a new midfield in here because I need someone else like some pace or something. Your pace is pretty good, bro. Like, what's going on? Take Tom Kearney out for your hands in. Let's try that. Oh, man. How can I suck more at home than I do away from home? We destroyed Tottenham Hotspur away from home. And now we're at home to... I mean, away from home. Yeah. Now we're at home to Burnley. We're getting our ass fucking kicked. Can't even get a shot off. What is that shit? That's it, we lost. That's it, we fucking lost. That's it. I don't know why we suck at home. We're not gonna be able to score in time. Because we can't fucking keep the ball for some reason. And... We're just gonna call in like five seconds. Oh, fuck. Why do I suck at home? Like, why do I just... Why can't I just fucking win a game? Like, and win it, like really nicely why can't i just <laughs> be faithful to my fans at home who pay all this money to come watch us at home and we end up losing two games in a row they're gonna be like you know what we're not going home anymore and now our next game against mansfield town i won't be surprised if we lose that either but to get to that one you guys are gonna have to wait till next episode because i gotta go take some more cough medicine because i want to go take a nice long nap but if you guys are new to this channel be sure to hit that subscribe button if, especially if you guys love american soccer and mls because that's the main focus of my channel Without further ado, guys, it's been a pleasure to play with y'all, or to play for you guys, um, whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys next time.